guys, welcome back to the channel. So in May, we saw Terra Luna Classic have a hundred, almost 100% 100 of his value wiped away. And with this, we saw Luna supply go from 1 billion coins to over 6.5 trillion coins. And this was before Terra's latest hold. And of course, this was in May. Now, the reason why a lot of people in the community want to see tokens burn, because we want to see supply be reduced. We know a lot of people understand that as long as there's so many coins in circulation, we are not going to see Terra Luna Classic, uh, you know, hit that $119 all time high or, or, or however, mu however much it was at the time. In fact, let's just double check. Yes, I believe it was $119 before it crashed. We know we're not going to see that again as long as we have such a huge supply. Now, this is why the tax burn is so important. This is why the burn of Terra Luna tokens are so significant to that of the community because we know with a reduced supply, it should equal more demand. And not only that, we should also see a price go up in value and be able to hit at least the $1 mark, you know, let alone, you know, that $10, $20, etc. right? Now, what would a $7 trillion burn essentially mean? What this will mean, guys, is we will basically go back to how Terra Luna Classic was when we first started. And that's when Terra Luna Classic had that 1 billion uh, coins in circulation. So let me just show you guys, uh, because not a lot of people understand this. And, you know, the videos that you are watching, maybe they're not getting into the backstory uh, as well, right? Because when you hear about all these token burns, not many people understand the purpose of it. Many people just see it as something to be done, but we're trying to replicate something. We're trying to basically get Terra Luna Classic back to its initial state. Now, this is Terra 2. As you can see, the current price is $1.85, and it has a market cap of $236 million. Luna Classic has a market cap of over $1.8 billion, uh, $1 billion, but yet its price is, hasn't even hit one cent yet, let alone a dollar, right? And the reason why is because Terra 2, what they've done is they've basically gone back to how things were before, where we have a total supply of a billion tokens and 127, uh, 127 million coins in circulation, right? Which is why you can see a $1.85 price rather than a price less than Terra Luna Classic, even though Terra Luna Classic has a larger market cap than uh, Terra 2. So I hope that's all clear for all of you. So now let's go back and talk about what this means, a, a token burn means. It means essentially we should see the price inflate natural, it's actually artificially rather than naturally, but we should see the price, uh, you know, appreciate in value and go up in value artificially, right? Because what we're doing is removing coins from circulation to increase price so as long as we get these token burns happening and happening regularly we're going to see terra luna classic let me just go back to it guys we're going to see in fact i'll show you the actual chart we're going to see terra luna classic continue its upside momentum and it should happen a lot faster as the tokens burn so seven trillion dollar coin burn basically brings us back to day one and hopefully we can see terra luna classic hit its all times all time highs again of 119 um 119 dollars now of course this isn't going to be easy you know i'm not going to sit here and pretend that this is something that can happen overnight i'm not even going to pretend that it's something that is 100 percent guaranteed but one thing for certain is we are seeing progress and the price is reflecting that. So it's going to be very interesting to see the journey over the next few weeks and months and what actually happened. Uh, so, sorry, what actually ends up happening and why it's so important to stay tuned uh, for this project because guess what guys? This could literally be the greatest comeback in cryptocurrency history, right? So let's see, with a token burn of 7 trillion, this thing goes to the moon. So I'm staying, I'm saying, in my, I'm keeping my eyes peeled. I'm staying up to date with what's actually happening with this because I understand just how significant a token burn of this size would 
actually be. But let me know what you think in the comment section. Let me know if you, there's anything that you think I could uh, be updating on. Let me know in the comment section as well. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And as always, click the bell notification icon so you can stay up to date with all my recent videos. Remember guys, nothing that you've seen in this video is financial advice. So always make sure to do your own independent research. And with that being said, pause the video, click the link in my description and join the Telegram group so you can stay up to date with all my recent updates, news updates, technical updates and much much more guys to the moon and beyond let's see how high this rocket ship can go with that being said guys seize the day